In a previous episode, we found the Big Dipper, the asterism that's part of the constellation Ursa Major, the Great Bear. No matter the time of year, the Big Dipper is generally in the northern sky. It might be low in the north, or high overhead and upside down, or a bit northeast or northwest, but it's always in the northern half of the sky. We're going to use the Big Dipper to find an important star, the North Star. To find the North Star, look at the Big Dipper part of Ursa Major. The two stars in the edge of the Dipper's bowl farthest from the handle are called the Pointer Stars. If you draw an imaginary line between them and then keep going, they point right to the North Star. The North Star is part of a constellation called Ursa Minor, the Little Bear. The same stars make up the asterism, or star pattern, of the Little Dipper. The entire sky appears to spin around a point very close to the North Star. If you think of the sky as a big globe surrounding us, then the North Star is where you would put the North Pole and attach the globe to the stand. It's basically the North Pole of the sky. That's actually where the North Star's other name comes from. The North Star is also called Polaris. Of course, it's not really the sky spinning around us. We're the ones doing the spinning. The planet Earth spins around once every day, which gives us sunrise and sunset, day and night, and makes everything in the sky appear to move. So now you know how to find your directions at night. Find Polaris, and the spot directly under the North Star on the horizon is True North. Subscribe to hear more about the stars and planets you can see at night, and make sure you visit the Manitoba Museum's website, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, where you can download some fun activities and other videos to keep you occupied at home. See you next time.